Hello, and welcome to our Family Information Nights for the school year 2021-2022. My name is Ms. Hunter, and I'm the Counseling Program Coordinator here at SVCTE. I'm happy to introduce to you more information about our courses in the Automotive Services Pathways. They are taught by Mr. James Walker, Brakes and Alignment, as well as Mr. Tom Nemeth, Electrical. Please find here their direct contact information. This presentation will discuss the Canvas Learning Portal as well as industry standardized curriculum that is being offered, industry recognized certifications, how students obtain their letter of competency, and even if students want to be their own boss and own their own small business. We cover all of that here tonight. But first, it's very important that we share with you our own SVCTE Supra. This is a turbocharged Supra, and it goes super fast. Here is the inside of our shop. It looks just like a car dealership. This is Mr. Namath, and he is showing the students how to wire and test using a multimeter. This is one of our students working on a wheel probably looking at those rotors. Here's Mr. Namath directing students on how to read the directions so that they can wire under the engine hood. This here is a relatively new equipment that we've acquired. This is the, an alignment laser and it's connected to a camera system. It'll tell students if the wheels are in perfect alignment. And Mr. Walker is the expert on this system. Students here are learning more about how to take off a wheel and put a wheel back on. They're also checking the brake pads and the rotors using calipers. Here's a student working directly in the engine. And here are students building lifelong friendships and just having a good time while they're being COVID responsive. See their masks? We like to let students know that these classes are recognized by the California Department of Education as a capstone course pathway. Students are fulfilling a sequence of coursework in the transportation sector. These classes are both backed up to CTE anchor standards. Both of our instructors are using Canvas, which is an online learning management portal. This is really great because it means that students can access their class anytime, anywhere, as long as they have online connectivity. Both of our instructors are using industry standards based curriculum. Specifically, they are preparing students with an accredited program under the ASE. That stands for Automotive Service Excellence, and it is the standard for the automotive industry. These two classes together will specifically help students prepare for the areas of the test known as A4, A5, A6, which are suspension and steering, brakes, and electrical systems. This is a good start for students to be ready when they take the ASE test in their future. The curriculum is also accredited by NATEF. If students are eligible to return for their second year by teacher recommendation, then it's really a great opportunity for them as SVCTE has car dealerships right in their own backyard. You've seen them. They're all the dealerships on Capital Expressway. <laughs> so students can report to their teacher and then follow up by reporting directly to their internships. It's a really great hands-on fieldwork experience for second year students while they get to continue under the mentorship of their teacher. Students will be taking the OSHA 10 this year. This should be part of their career portfolio. It is also industry recognized for safety, safety standards. 
In this program, students will prepare for Skills USA. This is a competition, competition based uh, student run organization. The advisors are Gina Fleming and Nathan Chooks. Our SVCTE Center has been the regional test site for many years in the past. Once students place medals at the regional, then they can move on to state. The state competition will be held in Ontario, California in the month of, of April, April 21st through the 24th. Every year, we have an annual car show. This is our biggest fundraiser for the Skills USA students. This helps us raise money so that the students can travel to and from the competitions as well as prepare them with their necessary uniforms. The annual car show is coming up on Friday, May 6th, 2022. It starts at 5 p.m. and goes through 8.30. Spectators are free, but if you have a custom or classic car or motorcycle that you would like to enter, it's just 20 bucks and the proceeds go for a good cause. Please reach out to Mr. Bob McTaggart. He is the organizer in the auto body repair. Students who are interested in competing in this upcoming competition for 2022 under the Automotive Service Technology will be as follows. Contestants will demonstrate their ability to perform jobs and skills based on the task listed outlined by the National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence, known as ASE. Also, the accrediting agency, National Automotive Technicians Education Foundation, NATEF. Workstations consist of on-vehicle, simulation, bench and component testing, and a written test. Contestants are, contestants are judged on technical competency, accuracy, quality, safety, and ability to follow instructions. There are 13 skills stations, including the written test. Boy, oh boy, when our students compete, they receive a wonderful certification that definitely boosts their career portfolio. So please, if you're interested in helping us fundraise, please donate $20, which is tax deductible, and you will receive a receipt. By the end of this course, both courses with Mr. Walker and Mr. Namath, you will receive a letter of competency if you have been recommended and successfully completed with a uh, grade of C or better. The areas that you will be uh, demonstrating comp competency are in engine repair, brakes and suspension, electrical, as well as professional and college and career readiness. Again, a great addition to any career portfolio. We also like to let students become aware of the local community colleges that continue uh, the post-secondary options for the automotive services pathways. These would be located with De Anza College as well as Evergreen Valley College. You can see here that at both college systems, you can achieve either a Certificate of Achievement or an Associate of Science degree. Please see the further information at the end of this presentation where you can learn more about scholarships and the Promise Grant, which pays for students to attend college for free for the first two years right out of high school. Also, please find that if your student is interested in going straight to the workforce, think about becoming an apprentice. Apprentice get paid while they learn. They also get to work under the mentorship of a journeyman. They get to make approximately 50% of what the journeyman's wage is. Students will need to sit for a written exam. They need to complete their high school or GED diploma. They will have to pass physical requirements. The program is 48 months long. The program is located here in Santa Clara County at the Automotive Repair Trades JA and EAC. 
located on almaden road please see the coordinator mr tim cooper for further information they are hiring continuously or maybe you would like to manage and own your own automotive shop think about seeking a mentor through the SCORE program of Silicon Valley. They have many volunteers available to help you create a business plan and even apply for a small business loan. Check them out for a startup and a roadmap guide-by-guide -guide step on how to open up your own small business. We also encourage students that if you're out there working, you may want to ensure that you're working with a union shop. By staying close to your union, you get to work side by side with other fellows who are looking out for your best interests. They help you ensure that you have good working conditions, um, satisfying pay, as well as other protections and information. So please check them out. The local union 1101 is specific to the automotive services and auto mechanics. So thank you so much for listening, everyone. If you do have further questions or need further information, please reach out to both of your instructors, Mr. James Walker or Mr. Tom Nemeth. If you need more information about financial aid and scholarships, then please follow the orange button on the link below where you found this presentation. Take care and have a good night. Bye.